Hi everyone, Frankie here at New West Reset. Hello, how's it going? Welcome back. Thanks for joining me here today. Another assorted random. So, um, really no. I'm gonna have to speak up. I'm practically gonna have to yell in this thing, eh? Because uh, it's really windy here today. But, uh, not really sure what the story is on this place. I know at one time back in the uh, 60s and 70s there was a bike shop. After that in the 80s and early 90s there was a music store like uh, CDs, cassettes, uh, vinyl records. But the uh, first thing I'm noticing here, this is the main entrance door here. Of course it's all boarded up and they've got posters slathered all over it. But you can see here, this is very stumpy man. Super stumpy door. It's maybe five and a half feet tall. It's got a window, a frosted glass window above it. Not really sure because the brick on here is a textured brick, but it looks really old. And it's a different textured brick than that textured brick, which it's kind of tied into here. So I'm not really sure what the deal is. Of course, it's got a whole bunch of paint slathered all over it. So I don't know if they're going to be knocking this thing down. It's got an interesting sort of kick out there along the roof line. Little detail right there. And then at that end too. I would imagine they're going to be knocking this thing down. Not really sure. But uh, it's pretty old. This header above the windows here, I, it looks like it's concrete and it's been painted. And then they've added in these large windows. Which are pretty old because they have wooden uh, window frames around them. So, yeah, let's uh, whip around here to the side and see what's going on with this thing. Right now I'm on, um, I'm between 11th Avenue and 10th Avenue Southwest on, uh, where am I? 9th Street. No, 8th Street. 8th Street and 11th Avenue Southwest. So you can see here the, the ground slopes downward here like this in the building. And, uh... That's concrete down along there. There's where that main door is. It's really stumpy looking. So now let's see what we can see around here. So they've got a whole bunch of boarded up windows all along the side here. Now this, this is the north facing side of the building and this is cinder block, which is kind of weird. So I don't know if, what has been refaced, where and when. I think must be concrete. They could be sandstone painted over, but you know, looks like it might be concrete. Pretty hard to tell. There's so many coats of paint on it. A little air vent up over there. And uh, look at this. Hello. That looks like a mud flooded window to me. Shooting right down. Look at that thing. Look at that. Let's see if we can get see a remnants of a wooden window frame right here and then all the snow is shoved in and dirt and crap and it's starting to crumble down but that looks like a mud flutter window to me let's see if we can see any others along here now the ground is starting to slope back up here toward the the back end of the building which faces west don't really see much else here along the bottom unless I'm missing something well, maybe potentially something in here I don't know Hard to say. Yeah, very interesting. This thing's just rotting away. I'm pretty sure they're gonna tear this down. It's probably too far gone to, to save. In the back of the building, this looks like it was a big sort of receiving door that they've blocked in and they put a window I guess at one point and now they've boarded that in as well getting some of the old insulators and the old light there that's kind of neat Got kind of a funny shack on the back here so maybe this goes down into what's a lower level in this thing maybe I don't know hard to say there's a lot of snow back here obviously but uh, let's see if we can see anything else around here not really just all boarded up 
This is the back to that adjacent building that's joined into the one we were just looking at here. And kind of very much of the same. A lot of boarded up windows, a million coats of paint. That looks like another old receiving door of some kind. Not sure. You can see a little bit of brick right along the top there above this cinder block. So I want to say underneath this layer of facade cinder block is maybe a layer of brick underneath that. Not too sure. Let's see if we can see up on top there where they join together. Got some uh, sheet metal flashing right along here and then it's like a wood, there's like a wood frame roof there I think. It's a pretty old building if it's got a wood frame roof. But other than that, not too much going on. We can see in here, a big chunk of cinder block missing. Wooden frame there inside. Probably the back of drywall or gypsum there. So yeah, I don't know. I don't know, very interesting. Interesting old building. But, uh, let's swing back around here. It's north facing, north facing side in the alley here. Yeah, that looks like that's that's about it. So I don't know, very strange building. There's a wood all along here too, along the top here. I just noticed. So yeah, very peculiar building. Air vent there, another little air vent right there too. Hello. Hmm. So yeah, very curious. Uh, again, no information on this thing. I know it's been here since at least uh, the, the mid '60s, because when I used to go in here when it was a record store. Uh, the guy who worked there said it used to be a bike shop back in the 60s, so, yeah, I don't know. But yeah, uh, they, there it is. I think that's going to seal the deal here today for this crazy old assorted random. Of course, uh, let me know what you think down below, as always. You know, just kind of beep, boop, bop it down there. And uh, until the next one, take care and have a good one.